konfigurácia. Warning. Odvozok. Minimálka warning. A chmé lietadlo. When the design team started working on Shark more than 15 years ago, they approached the aircraft safety from a really robust perspective and looked at dozens of aspects that they integrated into the design of the aircraft, making a very long list of safety features of Shark. I time to time say that our main main task is to bring our pilot back back on the ground alive. In the first part of this mini-series, we focus on aspects that increase the safety of the aircraft. In the second one, we describe how the aircraft protects the crew during an accident. One of the key characteristics of the aircraft is how it behaves as a stall. Shark install is a really, really gentle aircraft uh, because it has a, a symmetric stall in the clean configuration and on the flaps one. Warning. Check here. Odvozok. Minimalka warning. It has a lot of uh, warning from the landing gears, from the dynon. Farming, minimalka, odvozky. Pracenie a zabrana pádu. And, and finally, even aerodynamic warning. Just now we are improving this uh, on this aircraft, uh, installed the stall stripes, which uh, significantly improve aerodynamic warning before the stall. With flaps uh, two and flaps three, we have stall on the one, one side, mostly left wing, but uh, to recover from the stall is, is very easy, so it's just too realistic and aircraft uh, goes, goes, to, goes to stabilized flight back. Uh, Shark is uh, uh, very, very easy to control on the high speeds, uh, 300 kilometers up down, it's, it's, it's really really nice to, to fly it with the speeds, but a lot of, a lot of people is surprised that it's uh, really nice to fly it in, in the low speeds. So, so you can easily fly down to 120 km per hour, what is about 60 knots. And again, aircraft is fully controllable. It's safe, uh, it's easy and nice to fly even on these speeds. Another feature of Shark uh, is a big tailplane. The so-called uh, tailplane volume is by 35% bigger than is uh, usual. And uh, it results uh, into excellent controllability on slow speeds, great stability, and also Shark is not very sensitive to changes of uh, CG position. Another safety feature of the Shark is a very low landing speed, which is given by very efficient Fowler flaps. The airfoil of the Shark was, was calculated and optimized by genetic algorithm to, to, for, the, for the design point, to, to really be the fast and the, and the design speed, what is about 300 km per hour. And while the, the airfoil has maximum lift coefficient, I think 1.2 or 1.3, so with the Fowler flap uh, deflected to 
40 degrees, close to 40 degrees, lift coefficient of the wing uh, is three. So it's, it's a really incredible number. I flew another type of the ultralights, some of them easy to land, some of them not so easy. Shark is uh, really easy to land. Uh, it's uh, thanks to, we have, uh, we use Fowler flaps and flaps two and flaps three uh, gives a lot of lift, but as well as a lot of drag. So Shark is not sensitive uh, to for the long flaring above the ground with the ground effect because the, the drag of the flap is high so, so it really goes down quite easy. System of retracting of landing gears on the shark is operated electric. We have two, two servos, two actuators, one big for the main landing gear once more from the fro for the front leg and uh, uh, if gears are retracted uh, the actuators are in reality locked so in case of of uh, electric failure that aircraft has, has not electric power we have uh, emergency release handles if you need uh, emergency open landing gears you you pull pull the handle for the left for the front and for the right wheel and uh, there, will, there is hook which which will be opened uh, gear is unlocked and 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 falls down with the weight then, it, then there is gas spring and there is steel spring which which locks the system next detail which you see regarding the landing gears as uh, we have windows on the one wing, left wing right wing and even on the front where you can see the flag on the and when the leg is open and locked uh, flag with with uh, with arrows uh, two arrows are uh, or pin oriented pins each other and and pilot is pilot is sure that that landing gear is locked uh, if now we will give order if we would switch it it will don't retract uh, because we are on the ground and in the system is safety switch. If you don't have the speed, which is adjusted to 120 km per hour, which is about 65 knots, it don't allow you to retract the landing gears. Next, you see here, the, this is a plug uh, on the instrument panel. If you want to bypass mostly in, in case of some maintenance, if you have lifted aircraft on the jig, so, and you need to test the landing gear, so you need to bypass this safety switch. So here is plug where you, where you put, uh, put the fuse and it will bypass this, this safety, safety switch in the aircraft. We have uh, two groups of uh, pilots flying uh, aircrafts with a retractable landing gear. Uh, one group of pilots already had belly landing and the other group of pilots uh, still waiting for their belly landing. Our customers had uh, several belly landings uh, in past and uh, usually it's not a big issue to return aircraft back into operation. Majority of belly landings and with the sliding of the aircraft on the uh, inner flap bracket and on the engine cowlings, some damages are not significant and are easily easy repairable. One of the safety aspects of the airplane is the view from the cockpit, which is great for both short as well as tall pilots. A big part of safety is to see and to be seen. So the view from the shark cockpit is excellent in all directions. It's comparable with the gliders or jet fighters. And uh, everybody will see you thanks to the strobe lights, landing lights and the position lights. All sharks which we produce today and deliver uh, equipped with uh, autopilot. For me, autopilot is one of the most important uh, 
most important systems which increase the safety of flights because it significantly reduces the workload of the pilot. Significantly. Mm -hmm. Shark is aircraft designed for the long flights and absolutely, absolutely, absolutely I recommend to have and use autopilot. Even the, a lot of aircraft uh, has installed the anti-collision system. Today, again, uh, the technology which is available and uh, even in this small aircraft you are able to pay it. And uh, this as well brings next, uh, next uh, step in uh, safety of flight because uh, you can see on the display, on the map, uh, uh, aircraft which, which are nearby, which are close to you, which are on collision course, so the same altitude. Už nás minul. Traffic. Ozval sa traffic. Traffic. Že aj zvuková ulica. In anti-collision uh, here is a combination of two technologies. One is ADS-B in and out and uh, next one is FLARM, which is mostly used on the gliders. Because Shark is a very fast airplane, we pay big attention to flutter phenomena. If you have electric failure, you can have a problem. Yeah? Next uh, problem or possible problem which we was solving in the past was uh, vapor lock. 